Hello, my name is Robert Dean Steele, and this is Promises of the Bible. James says in James 2.13, he says, Because judgment without mercy will be shown to anyone who has not been merciful, because merciful mercy triumphs over judgment. Now, we do have to be extremely careful when it comes to making judgments on people. Because when we make judgments on people, basically what we are doing is we are putting our standards and convictions on them may not necessarily be their standards or convictions. Now, there are some really powerful standards found in the Word of God. But most of what we judge people on is our own convictions and our own ways of seeing the Bible. And what James is saying, he says, listen, be very careful when you put judgments on someone without mercy because what will happen to you is that when that judgment or judgment comes on you, it will be without mercy. Basically what he's doing and saying is like what Paul said in Galatians 6, 8. He said basically this, whatever a man sows, that will they will reap. So <laughs> another way of putting it is what goes around comes around. So be very, very careful when you judge. Now, the Bible does say that there are certain things that we can judge, and that is the fruit of someone's life. So if you come into contact with someone who says, for example, that they are a Christian and they um, aren't exhibiting the um, fruit of the Spirit, you can say, hmm, I really wonder if they are a Christian. Now that doesn't mean that you go around and spread gossip about them or bring judgment against them and try and bring them in. But basically, we can say, wait a minute. I need to speak to you. I, I'm concerned about your situation. Always do it with love and uh, always do it with the whole idea of bringing about total victory for their lives. So be very, very careful. Whenever you are called of God to do something, always do it with love and always show mercy. Otherwise, James says, you will not be showing mercy when you might find yourself in a fault. Well, good advice to follow. Also, some other scriptures to look at is John 7.24, Romans 2.1, and Ephesians 4.32. My name is Robert Dean Steele with uh, Promises of the Bible. You have yourself a great and godly day.